Hey guys, what is up? It is Kylie. I'm so excited to be doing today's video. Long time, no see. It's been like three weeks. I feel like every video there's like a month in between, but I, one of these days, will post like so many videos and you guys will be like... But I promise, I have a ton of videos planned for March and this was one of them. If you guys remember, I had Ipsy for like a year and a half. I never did any unboxings or videos on it. I don't know why. But I didn't, but I recently subscribed to Sephora Play and I got my first one. So I kind of want to do like a review on it. If you guys want to see one every month, make sure to comment down below because I would love to do that. And also, make sure to check out my last video, which was a makeup collection. It will definitely be linked down below and it's my last video before this whenever you're watching this. So. Also, comment some spring videos, summer videos, whatever videos you guys want to see down below. Here's the box. Um, so, of course I've already opened it, but... It's still fine. So the first thing, okay, this is the this is the inside of the box. It says love tips, tricks, and beauty hacks, Sephora.com slash play. So yeah, okay. So then um this is the little card sheet thing. I like I'm gonna kind of be comparing this to Ipsy since I had Ipsy for like two years. I think I know a little bit about Ipsy. So I didn't really like this card better. It's not just like a random card that you're just gonna throw away. Um it actually it Comes with a little card, which is 50 beauty insider points, which would be spending $50 at Sephora, unless it's like double points or whatever. But I've heard some people say that you have to, like, depending on who's working, you may or may not have to have a purchase, purchase something in order to use this, but I'm not sure. And the theme was share, or feel the love, share the love, I'm not sure. Um, but this is a little card, apparently you're supposed to, like, give these to all your friends, but I actually ripped it, so they're, like... It's just little Valentine's so you're supposed to give to people. And another thing that I really like is that it tells you about the products, kind of why I love it, how to use it, about the brand, whatever, and kind of just a quick little summary on it. So these are all the things that I got in my box. I got six things, so I usually get five things plus a sample. If you guys have any questions about the box or just anything, make sure to comment them down below. So now is the actual bag. So I don't really like these bags. I don't really feel like I'm going to use them or anything. Like what am I going to use this little thing for really nothing to be honest so yeah that sucks but I'm not gonna use this little thing but it's still cute and I'll still keep it um I guess you could throw like your foundation or some makeup in here it's a cute little bag though but um it says feel the love on it and it says hashtag support play and there's a girl and her hair is a heart so cute okay so I'm gonna take my, my little thingy okay so um gonna grab something I've already opened this obviously my hair is so frizzy from this rain and wintry weather I do not like the winter at all I'm such a summer person at least summer weather so this ugh, my hair gets so frizzy and annoying and it's just annoying me sorry so this was my um, extra sample and usually they give out perfume samples but I've been hearing that they've been giving out like hair masks and hair things for samples but I got the amazing grace perfume and yeah, this is what it looks like. Um, I already have this, but I'm still going to keep it. I'm only going to be keeping two out of these six things in this box, by the way. Um, because I don't want to keep products that I'm not going to use and that are just going to sit in the drawer and expire. So, yeah. So this is what... I'll be keeping this because I go through these little samples pretty fast. And I think they're nice to have around. The next thing is the First Aid Beauty Ginger Turmeric Vitamin C Jelly Mask. So I'm not really into skincare. Well, I like skincare, but I don't really like changing up my routine because I'm always afraid that I'm going to break out. I'm going to break out from it. So I think I'm going to give this to one of my friends. And if you guys want to know how it is, I'll ask her. Um, because she loves trying new skincare and like baths and stuff. And I believe she has sensitive skin. And it says safe for sensitive skin. So I'm sure that she'll love this. So if you guys want to know um, how it worked, I'll definitely ask her. Okay, this is the... Peter Thomas Roth Firmex Peeling Gel Gel Exfoliant. Um, this is another skincare product that I will not be keeping. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this. Um, I don't know. I saw this on Sephora Play every month. It does kind of like a what you get, what you can get in your box type of thing. And I saw this on there and I thought it was really cool, but I'm not going to use it. Next is this mascara, which I'll be keeping as well. This is the Too Faced It Better Than Sex Mascara. It's a really good mascara. You can get really long lashes from this. I already actually have a sample of this. It's a little bit bigger. Um, but it's a great mascara and I'll be keeping this because I'm always trying to use up or trying to use new mascaras. So. 
Okay, the next two products are lip products, and they give you two lip products this month to um, share one with a friend. So basically, on this little thing right here, it says, Psst, we get that was really creepy. Um, we've given you two lip products this month so that you can share one with a friend. So I don't wear lip products because my lips get chapped very easily, no matter if it's a lip balm or anything. So I try to stay away from lip products and putting anything on my lips besides besides what um, I can't use any like store bought lip balm. I have to use a special thing that got prescribed to me from the dermatologist. So yeah. So this is the Sephora Collection um, Ultra Shine Lip Gel in Perfect Nude. This is actually a beautiful nude color. Um, it's just super pretty. So if I could wear lip products, I'd definitely keep this one and give the other one away. I'll probably be a smile on because I know that she likes to wear lip products. So, yep. And then... The other one that I got is Makeup Forever Artist Roos Matte Matte High End Matte High Pigmented Lipstick in M500. So it comes in this cute little box, and this is what it looks like right here. Um, this says, yeah, it's this right here. Super cute little thing, and it's this darker red color. When I actually first received this, I was pretty mad um, because it, like. The little thing, the little tip of it is crushed because when I first received this, it actually was not attached to the product. Like, it was not attached atta <laughs> It was not attached to the base. It was actually just, like, it was just broken. So, yeah, but that's that. It looks more of, like, a reddish, like, wine color now, but it used to look more like of like a purple so that's kind of weird maybe it's just a light that is everything that i got in my bag if you guys want me to do one of these next month make sure to comment down below and if you guys want to see any other videos from me make sure to comment down below give this video a thumbs up and check out my last video which was a makeup collection and i'll see you guys in my next video bye